In this video, we will solve a problem on production function and marginal product of capital. The question is, consider the production function that is y is equal to minus x cube plus 6x square plus 15x where y is the output and x is the input which is capital here. For what value of x will the marginal product of capital start decreasing? The options are x is equal to 1.5 x is equal to 2, x is equal to 3, or x is equal to 8, okay? So, first of all, what we are being given, we are being given the production function, that means output is a function of labor, sorry, capital here, that is minus x cube plus 6 x square plus 15 x. This is our production function. So, let's first find out the marginal product of capital. And what is marginal product of capital? Simple. It is the derivative of production function with respect to capital. That is with respect to x here. Okay, so x denotes the capital here. So taking derivative of this function with respect to x. So derivative of x cube is minus 3x square plus derivative of x square is that is 2 6 are 12 exponent becomes coefficient it gets multiplied with this 6 so 6 2 are 12 x we have 12 x plus the derivative of x in 15 x is 1 so we are left with 15 this is our marginal product of capital okay for this marginal product of capital to start decreasing our first order condition requires that is our first order condition requires that the derivative of marginal product of capital with respect to uh, capital which is denoted by x should be equal to zero okay so let us draw the graph here to make it more reasonable to understand okay so our graph will look like this if i denote here units of capital by x on horizontal axis and the marginal product of capital on vertical axis then marginal product of capital it is graph is a quadratic one so it will look like this okay so this is our mpk mpk okay so for this marginal product of capital to sit our diminishing the derivative of this marginal product of capital function should be equal to zero that means when it is at maximum when the slope of this uh, mpk curve is equal to zero this point denotes our d mpk upon dx it should be equal to zero okay when it reaches maximum obviously then it will start diminishing okay so we need to find out this very point now that means we need to take the derivative of this marginal product of capital function again and set it equal to zero derivative of x square is 2x so 2 into minus 3 is minus 6 so we have minus 6x uh, plus derivative of x in 12x is 1 so we are left with 12 it should be equal to 0 okay now transposing this 6x on RHS this will become 6x or let us write it like this is equal to transposing this here it is minus 12 minus minus gets cancelled which gives us x is equal to uh, 12 upon 6 which comes out to be 2 okay so um, the thing is that when our capital are two units our you know marginal product of capital is maximum and after that it starts diminishing okay so the value of capital okay from which our marginal product of you know capital starts decreasing is two okay i hope i make myself clear in this video thank you